uh, Easter Monday from Australia and New Zealand for 400 plays. Wouldn't that be neat? Just because we can. What also I did not know, and I think this is great, and maybe you didn't know this either. Um, April 11th is Holocaust Remembrance Day, but I did not know that it began at sundown. Am I the last person to know this? If I am, don't make fun of me. Actually, I don't care. You can make fun of me. But maybe there is going to be somebody out there that didn't know this either. What is Anzac Day? And it's like in great giant all caps letters. So maybe maybe it means something. That's in Australia and New Zealand. Um, tell me about it, guys. Tell me what your days mean. <laughs> Please educate me because I do not understand. Okay? And also... Um, why don't they have the definitions to these words in the back of these calendars? I think they should. Ed Sheeran, why don't you have it? You know, like, uh, what is that, Day Runner that had, like, you know, those giant book things that, oh, God, because I love to write. I write stuff. Even if I don't like it, I will rewrite it. I will crumble it up, and I will rewrite it. Now they have, oh, now they have those, um, that not the white out that you can like smell. It's like a little paint brush, but it's that stuff. It's that stick stuff, that sticky stuff. It's like that little tape and you just, and it comes in little colors and you can just like slide it over your ink pen stuff to just carefully cover it. Oh, I love that stuff. I go through that stuff like a lot. I should own stock in that. Anyway, if anybody wants to buy me a present, you can get me some stock in that. What is that paper mate or whatever? Um, so yeah, so I just would love to, learn a little bit more on who celebrates what kind of day. You know, a lot of stuff is going on in the world right now. The news is just obnoxious with crap out there. You know, people are getting murdered. People are going to prison because they're trying to get their own memorabilia back. And, you know, people are telling about other people. They're sleeping with other people and they're living in the same house with their last name's Kardashian. Who cares? Okay, let's... Look at something exciting. Let's figure out what's going on on the other side of the planet that's positive for once. I mean, geez, Manise, man, you know, I don't watch the news in front of my children because it's terrifying. And I'm not trying to keep my children away from reality because, trust me, my world is a reality show. Everybody's world is a reality show. We don't need one more reality show. Ryan Seacrest is full. His plate is full, people, okay? What we need is some little happy time. So what I am asking you guys to do, if you have your own calendar, why don't you grab it? And if you see something that's kind of off the wall um, or something that I didn't mention that's not normal, you know, like full moon or Easter or, you know, like St. Patrick's Day or Valentine's Day, put it on my Facebook page and let's like discuss it. I think it'd be just kind of fun just to like do a little calendar movement, you know, but mine has Ed Sheeran on it. So it's really, really fast. This whole thing's fascinating, and hopefully you guys got something out of it today because I felt like a teacher, and I feel really smart, and I've got my little nerd glasses on. And hopefully Jeremy Harrell is listening to me because he's like to be all dirty and nerdy. Did you guys see that I got his shirt? I am also wanting to sport everybody's merch, so please let me know how I can get your merch, and I will definitely help you guys out. Support is my middle name, twice removed. And back again. I'll post it and I'll blast it and I'll wear it with pride. Well, this is the Songbird for Songbird Indie Radio on the Flock Show. If you heard it come out of my beak right here on Songbird Indie Radio, if you saw it on the Ed Sheeran calendar, or if you read it on the internet, it just might be true.
drinking beer and watching baseball on your old TV. That's all you do. Days go by before you even. Jack's new song, She's Back in Town, and we got the man with the plan with the Hill Jack's fans. Oh, man, that rhymed. Sometimes I am just on, like Donkey Kong. They're here in the chirp chat with me right now. We got a double dose, and that means two, back to back. Here's a little too late. Should have done this and I should have done that. I should have should've been, been there, there and he never left. left. I should have been here. Should have been 
station online yeah that's us cause we play this freeway signs and faded blacktop Backstage doors and parking lots That's the world I mostly see Staring out a wide window A thousand miles away from my home That's the gypsy in me Stay one place too long There's somebody out there Still ain't heard my song Yeah, so I roll on Where this road leads me That's the gypsy in me But old guitar and a microphone I stand up here And sing what I believe Then I close my eyes and fold my hands Thank God I got a girl that understands And loves the gypsy in me Stay in one place too long There's somebody out there Who still ain't heard my song Yeah, so I roll off Where this road leads me Let's the gypsy in me Never heard I walk the line. Free bird, are you always on my mind? Ramblin' man, or oh, me and Bobby McGee. If I'd never seen the man in black, I wouldn't feel the need to wear this kind of hat. And there wouldn't be the gypsy in me. 